Jews have made every country in which they have lived rich except Israel. <laughs> you know why? why? Because it is written with socialism and histocrut and bureaucracy and red tape and tissue and every shayot and every shayot and every shayot. Throw the bureaucrats into the sea. Not the Arabs, just the bureaucrats. <laughs> Turn Israel into a free enterprise state. Let people who want to make money come into Israel. Build us a factory. No tax in 10 years, 20 years. But build us a factory. Give us jobs. Export. Hard, hard uh, currency. Make Israel what Singapore is. And we'll be 20, 20 times greater than Singapore. We have the technology. We have the talent. We have the brains. Billions will pour in into that country. Who needs foreign aid? I don't want foreign aid. I want to see Israel stand on its own feet. In Chicago, a person wants to open a store, finds a store, an empty store, opens a store, come out, finish. In Israel, ah, an invention. <laughs> it's an invention. <laughs> Need a permit, then a license to get the permit, then a license to get that, then a permit to get the license to get the, the, the permit, and you're going crazy. <laughs> Until you finally go to someone with protexia, protexia. And then he says, no problem, but remember, you owe me. That's how the parties grow. That's, that's why they don't want this. What do you think? I'm smarter than them. They are now. They know exactly what I know. Why don't they do it? Because political power is built on economic power. And if there was free enterprise, who needs parties? Who needs protectia? That's why they don't do it. That's why, please God, when we have power, not only will the Arabs go, but so will the Red Tape. And on that day, 200,000 Yodim, who left Israel, will go 